sure when he uh, had me think, oh, that kid's going to be the CG of Paris Island someday. Yeah, I'm sure he didn't think that. Why do you think they selected you to come here and take command of Paris Island? You know, I, I, I really don't know. I, I mean, uh, I, I didn't have the background in recruiting or recruit training, but I have the background in leading. The commandant just, when he gave me the job and bestowed that honor on me, uh, you know, I was really, I was really humbled when I was told that that's where I was going. Because it wasn't on my list of things I thought I ever had the potential to go to. I dreamt about it. I was like, wow, could I ever be the commanding general of Paris Island? But then my career path has never taken me toward that. I felt like that little kid in high school that I was getting told I was going to be starting. The guidance he told me was, just go down there and be Sparky Renforth. When you learned of re Recruit Siddiqui's past, right. when you saw some of the other things that have transpired since, what was going through your head when you thought about assuming command? Well, all I could do coming down here was talk about the future. I couldn't dwell on the past and what has happened because I wasn't here when that happened. I wanted to talk about winning and, and how we were going to win as a Marine Corps and win as a depot and, and how we were going to do the things that we're supposed to do as a, as a command. Have you taken any specific actions you yourself to address anything that transpired before you got here? Nothing more than I would have done anywhere else I would have ever gone. You know, uh, trying to lead these guys in such a manner that they want to feel like they're part of something special. I want them to understand the, the importance of their mission and, and uh, how institutionally involved they are. You know, they're at Paris Island. Now, this is a great place to be, and I want them to understand that they're a part of that. And even the most minor infraction that they do here has really strategic implications. You, you can go to some infantry battalion and do something wrong. And it's not going to be read on the Washington Post. You do something wrong here in Paris Island, we have people like you coming to see me. What do you want your legacy to be? How do you want folks to remember you? Well, I want them to know I cared about them, that I genuinely cared for them. I say everywhere I go, I just want, I want to lead them and love them. You come to work every day and you're saying, I'm, I'm going to make this place better. What, what can I do to make this place better? So if we're all doing that together, and I just happen to be in charge at the time, then this place is going to be better in two years.